Greetings, family. God bless you amazingly. Thank you for being a part of this session. If you're seeing me for the first time, I am Pastor Igor and I would like to welcome you to this amazing family of love, Healing Word with Pastor Igor. Today, our word is going to be from the book of Luke chapter 6, verse 38. The scripture says, Give and it will be given back unto you a good measure pressed down shaken together and running over shall be poured into your bosom for the same measure with which you give the same shall be measured unto you give and it will come back to you you cannot beat god in giving you cannot beat god in giving you cannot outgive god there is nothing you have that you can give to God that God cannot top it over. He says what you give will be given back unto you. A good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over. When you give God your little, he multiplies it and gives you back abundance. When you give him small, he gives you back more than enough. Today, I want some people who are willing to put this word to test in their lives. And as saying, Pastor Igwe, I want to join you in this good deed that you want to do. It's back to school season here in my country, and I would like to help a few families send their kids back to school. Because of the social crisis we are having, a lot of kids are unable to go back to school. I know a few families personally that I would like to help and i want people who are willing to stand with me to send a kid back to school maybe you can cover their tuition fee maybe you can handle their uniforms and books just be the reason why a child goes back to school whatever you have to give fifty dollars a hundred i promise you if you give up to a thousand i will do a video with the whole family <laughs> Oh my God, I'm sorry. I will do a video with the entire family of that child you're helping. Walk you through the process. You're putting a smile on somebody's face, but I'm serious. I might be laughing, but I'm serious. I'm just trying to ease the atmosphere. But I need people who are saying, I want to give back. The Lord has blessed me. I'm not asking you to give to Pastor Igwe, but I'm asking you to join Pastor Igwe so that we can be the reason why these kids go back to school. I've put up a few pictures on this video. These are kids who are always around the church, participating in one way or the other. And I know so many families that greatly need the help you have to offer. I'm going to leave my account details and my email in the description of this video so that anyone who feels in their heart like God is saying I should do this can just drop something. The best way to act on an instruction that the Lord gives is while the spirit is still moving. To not procrastinate, oh, I'm going to do it later. This is the second time I'm bringing up something like this. The first time it was for the flood victims here in Boya and three people reached out and helped and they can testify that I kept them updated about everything we did for this family. Pictures, videos, immediately they happen. They get the reports. Reports from my organization signed and sealed. They got it all. That is why I'm leaving my email alongside the payment details in case you want to make a donation for a kid to go back to school. I want you to specify this is for tuition fees this is for books this is for uniforms just anything that the Lord lays in your heart to do the more you give the more it will come back to you a good measure pressed down shaken together and running over the lockdown is over schools will be resuming from tomorrow and there are a lot of kids who are still just hanging around not knowing what is going to happen to them this academic year and i cannot do it by myself but i know that i have a platform through which i can reach someone who would be able to be a blessing to these kids and that's why i'm bringing this year so please join me let's be a blessing to these kids